Hello friends welcome back to channel and today I will give you some suggestions on tier 3 selector and tier 3 guided quest. There are 20 characters available in the tier 3 selector. Whichever character you select in the tier 3 selector you will need that character's latest uniform to perform well. So all the characters available in this list will need their latest uniform to perform well. Without uniform none of these characters will perform well. Rogue is a good choice. If you have her latest uniform, she is good for PvP, but not now. She was good for PvP when she got her new uniform. About Storm, Storm is also good for PvE content, but you will need her latest uniform. Inhumans vs X-Men uniform. And she has a good support in this uniform. Cyclops is also a good choice, he is a good leader, he has a good support and he has good damage. And Sharon Rogers, she is really good with her latest uniform. About Ant-Man, he is definitely not a good choice for tier 3 selector. Venom would be a good choice. With his latest uniform, he will definitely help you in the ABX and World Boss Ultimate. Black Bolt is not a good choice for tier 3 selector. About Black Panther, I don't know because I don't have his uniform, Black Panther's uniform and Winter Soldier's uniform. Vision could be a good choice. With his latest uniform, Vision will definitely perform well. Captain Marvel could be a good choice. For PvP with her latest uniform, she can perform but I am not sure because I don't have her latest uniform. And Daredevil with his latest uniform, he is going to perform very well in the World Boss Ultimate. And he can also perform in PvP but not that much good as the other characters. I don't know about Loki because I don't have his uniform. And Spidey is definitely a good choice for the PvP and if you select Spidey then you must have his Spider-Man No Way Home integrated suit uniform which is available at 50% discount currently. Discount will expire in few days, so make a quick decision. And Thor is also a good choice because with his latest uniform, Thor is definitely going to perform very well in the PvE content. He is not good for PvP. Black Widow, I am not sure about her. And Ghost Rider is definitely good with his latest uniform. He is really good for PvE, he is not good for PvP but he is really good for dispatch mission, ABX, squad battle, dimension mission and world boss ultimate. About Iron Man, his latest uniform is good. And Hulk, he is really good with his latest uniform in the PvP but I am not sure about him in the PvE content and Captain America is a good choice but he is not performing very good he is not a meta with his latest uniform so I don't recommend to go with Captain America so these are the 20 characters available in the tier 3 selector now let's go to tier 3 guided quest you can complete tier 3 guided quest only for one character. 
There are two ways of completing tier 3 guided quest the easy way and the hard way the easy way is you can select the character which you already have to tier 3 and then you just have to complete the guided quest missions and you will acquire the rewards and the hard way is suppose you don't have tier 3 iron man and you are selecting Iron Man in the guided quest then you will have to advance him to tier 3 to successfully complete the tier 3 guided quest. This way you will have to invest material. So I would suggest to go with the easy way. So you don't have to invest any tier 3 material in the character. So which one you should pick? First of all if you select Iron Man you will get his this uniform at 50% discount and this uniform is good black widow you can skip her this uniform you can skip this uniform also you can also skip this uniform visions this uniform is good you can select him in the tier 3 guided quest then you can purchase his uniform at 50% discount You can skip this uniform and about the character expansion you cannot select these six characters in the tier 3 guided quest you will have to purchase this pack for 2500 crystals but i would suggest to purchase this pack only if you want to select carnage yes carnage is a premium character and if you select carnage in the expansion pack you can acquire a tier 2 carnage at 2500 crystals because some characters are available at 2500 crystals but you can only acquire 6 star character not tier 2 characters so only carnage is worth for this pack and i am going to select iron man not vision because i don't have tier 3 vision and i am going to complete tier 3 guided quest in the easy way because i do have tier 3 iron man and why i am selecting iron man because i have recently advanced doctor strange to tier 3 so i don't have sufficient titans record blast that's why i am selecting iron man so i will get titans records blast when i complete tier 3 guided quest so i am selecting iron man and one more thing if you don't have a single tier 3 character then you can select any character in the tier 3 guided quest and you can use the current 7th anniversary tier 3 selector for that character and you can definitely complete tier 3 guided quest easily select character let's see the reward the rewards are really awesome i will update the tier 3 guided quest reward list in the description so don't forget to check the description i will update the details in the description so you can see the spreadsheet which rewards you will get by completing tier 3 guided quest lots of gold lots of black antimatter eod tcp and lots of biometrics you can also upgrade to special plus pack but it is really costly for free to play 5750 crystals and you will get a tier 3 selector instantly if you purchase this pack and these are the characters available in the tier 3 selector you can also select tier 3 carnage through this pack you will get 1500 crystals back if you purchase this pack and complete the tier 3 guided quest so the cost 
of this pack would be 4250 crystals and a bonus tier 3 selector but i will not suggest for free to play to go for this pack so these are my suggestions for the tier 3 selector and tier 3 guided quest so see you in the next video and thanks for watching